It's something that we don't do um, uh, with great, the greatest of pleasure. I think they're now used to the um, uh, they're now used to the videos that we make. It's something that we don't do with the greatest of pleasure. Uh, got our uncle supporters over here with us making a racket. But yeah, listen, guys. Regardless of the comments that are made on YouTube, on TikTok, people people have to come. People have to come. Yeah, people people have to come. You know, twenty three thousand pounds. Another hundred thousand pounds needed to carry out court cases. Banning brothers, sixteen or so brothers. What are they going to do? All right, just let's hypothetically speak. If they ban people, what are they going to do? What are they going to do? You know, we haven't got these things up for no reason here. You know, we didn't print these because we're like demented or we've got some issues. We I got we got full time jobs. We're professional people. Look, even the police is here. Okay, you don't probably see them. Just 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 behind me there. You see that? Just there. So the police are here. They know about everything. They'll be here shortly as well with us. And, they watch these videos as well, we know that. They watch these videos as well. You know, they make false allegations that we're blocking the footpath, we're blocking protesters. All the issues relate to protesting in the masjid, legally, I'll put up a little script there. All the issues relate to protesting within, within the confines, confines of the masjid. What's this? The last one I checked was a public footpath. Public footpath, that's what it is basically. So they want to stop this, they want to stop this. Um, you know, don't, do not. Are you local to the area? Yeah? Yeah, brother, come here occasionally. Yeah, yeah. So basically, what's essentially happened here yeah, is they've taken sadqa money, they've taken out, they're using a hundred thousand pounds here yeah, to take brothers to court and so on and so forth. So we're telling Charity. people, yeah, we're telling people not to donate to these idiots, man. That's what they are. You know, they got these imams, they these supposed wannabe imams here, yeah, who like they've got no training, no nothing, basically. So they're trying a hundred thousand pounds. Once they look, they had four hundred thousand pounds left over by the previous committee. The previous committee, yes. Yeah? People on TikTok, on Snapchat, they always wonder, hey, explain us a story. Four hundred thousand pounds left over by the previous committee. False allegations. I myself, I myself, along with another brother behind us, spent two nights in um, what's that police station? Stoke Newington Police Station. Seriously? Stoke, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because of the fact, apparently, we harassed the chairman's sister, who apparently wasn't even here on the night that the protest took place. Harassed from across the road, really. Anyway, so um, uh, there's a lot of billboards. Put the billboards up. Apparently, apparently she, you know, she dropped the charges because it was fake. It was fake. It was fake. And a few days, a few days later, a few days later, they decided to report my son to Brent Social Services. To Brent Social Services. So this is the committee. This is the demeanor of the people that you're dealing with. They will, if they can't get you financially, they'll get you. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Listen, look. Listen, look. After a month, the police ban me. The police, the police banned me for a month from the premises, you can't come back. They dropped the charges against the other brother and myself after one month. Look, 